When I did my undergraduate degree, I, was, I made a number of friends who were doing the PhDs, the master's degrees, various different types of research. And over the course of several years, I realised that it was the path for me, if, obviously to progress in my career, but also to create something new, something interesting. My research is mainly orientated towards security purposes. Uh, it's attempting to ensure that people can't conceal objects in secure environments. Um, obviously, with the example of the Boston Marathon bombings the other week, we would hope that eventually my research or one of the groups would be able to prevent something like that. And for myself, I'm relatively new to the research myself, but it's the fact that in my work, the, each object has its own unique signature. And I never realised that before went in, so you can see that even something that's hidden behind clothing or in a wardrobe, something like that, you can actually see it and tell it, what it, for, it for what it is. For society as a whole, it would allow for a more secure environment. For example, you'd be able to perform standoff scanning to detect uh, concealed objects in train stations, in airports. It's completely non-invasive and completely non-harmful as well. So compared to existing technologies, there's very few of the risks that are there at the moment. I'm hoping once I've got my doctorate to continue in research, either within the academic environment or the wider engineering community. Uh, the facilities for engineering are excellent. Uh, all through my undergraduate degree and into my research, they've been out of this world. At the moment, we're upgrading some of the equipment for the research group, so it's going to get even better in the near future. And the laboratories where I'm now helping to teach as a teaching assistant have had continuous upgrades over the last couple of years and are much more functional. The academic staff are excellent. They're very approachable, very knowledgeable. Uh, I have found they can be a little busy sometimes, uh, obviously with heavy workloads, but they will always find time to slot you in.